What is up guys, MJP me back again once again and today uh, I'm going to be looking to take on Skylar uh, or at least get to the point where we will be able to defeat Skylar first thing next episode. Um, so I did heal my Pokemon off screen but I haven't done any story. And we have got quite a lot of um, we got quite a lot of encounters coming up. Um, not before this gym. I think we got two. Um, possibly even three if the grass is in the right place. Um, So, I'm thinking that So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do Route 6 and get the encounter for Route 6 and Celestial Tower and um, hopefully without battling anyone and then I will battle everyone before the gym um, I'll just cut it out because nobody really wants to see okay so this won't be randomized because um, it's a fungus so we'll just area laser and then we'll go get our actual encounter But I'm kind of worried, which is because if you saw there, on the same level as the fungus was, so hopefully me uh, grinding will help. Me grinding in Celestial Tower and Route 6 will help with my levels, and as soon as I cut back. Pokemon. Come on. Okay, so this should be our first encounter in Celestial Tower, which is a Stonefist. Okay, it's another electric type, um, which is a bit annoying. But to be fair, I'm not too mad about that. I will take it. Um, the thing is, I don't really think I can push it down. So I have a couple of quick balls. So I'll just hop onto a quick ball. And I'll just hope that I can catch it with a quick ball. Because that, that that would be really useful for kids. And we do, okay. So here's another member of the squad. And let's name it Mud Surprise. Or Moose Moose Supri Moose Supri There you go. So there's another Pokemon we can get. Um so head back to Route Six, get the encounter oh Route Seven, sorry. Um get the encounter for here. Right, so hopefully, what is it? A Piplop? Oh my gosh, and it's a level 32. So we'd only have four levels until I would have a powerful, powerful Empoleon. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Uh, I think I'm just going to have to quick ball it again. Because I think the starters actually have. I thought it was going to be quite difficult to get, um, if I remember correctly. Oh, okay, so let me try and endeavor 
Bite? Oh, okay. Okay, so that means that it's still got... Let me try a netball. Because it works well on more types. Okay, and then I'll just throw one more netball. I'll also wait for it to finish the bite. Come on. I know you want to join the team. Alright, so I'm just going to keep on throwing some netballs. Because I have quite a few. Two, three. Oh, come on, you stupid penguin. So, now that I got three shakes, I'm just going to carry on. Come on, penguini. Hmm. Oh, okay. Hmm. Come on. One, two, three. You can't do that twice. Why? Okay. So I'll go for one more net ball. Then I'll try a timer ball. And we'll see how that goes. One, two, three. Thank you. Okay. So we have Tux. Tux the Piplup. And when you... So glad I got a pickup. <laughs> I could not have coped with the love this. I would have been like, nope, 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 I refuse. And you have to go around this trainer. Up. Across. Through. Get uh, and you give me a T? No? So you gave me charge for me. Is that just black and white? Alright, so. No, uh, I'll go out and explore. There's no T in here. There's Spy Drop. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then you get very nice there after defeating the gym. So, I will see you guys in... As you know what, I'll face all the gym trainers first. And then I'll go off and train for the gym. Let me try and get puke tarsum levels.
So I'm going to run this way and I'm going to fight you. I'm gonna go for rock side. Boom. Goddamn, Pupitar. Goddamn. Just made it. So, as you can see, this gym can be quite tedious. Um, it can definitely take a while to complete. Um, so you have a sigil lift? Okay. Let's go for another rock slide. Ooh, you survived. My little bugger. Okay, okay. Of course. That's fine. Dang it. Suck it. So as you can see, the gym trainers are all level 40 and my team is basically level 37 so I will be doing a little bit of grinding before the next episode uh, before I face Skyla probably oh you stupid so I think there's Two more trainers after this one, and then um, probably leave Skyla for the next episode. So this episode could, in fact, be a shorter one, um, but we'll see. Dragon Breath. Okay. I see you, big dog. Boom. Get destroyed. Son of a gun. An arm pheasant? No, we'll stay in. Because what I really want to be happening, guys, is that um, hopefully in the next three episodes or so, um, I'll have a Tyranitar. Nice empowering the party, um, and that will complete the team for that point anyway. Because I don't see myself losing anyone. Hopefully, <laughs> um, it is going to get quite difficult. Really, it's going to get quite difficult um, in the next coming episodes because we have quite a lot of. Um, big battles like the sick gym um, and there's a lot of rival and team plasma battles as well um, so the next couple of episodes will be quite interesting to say the least so hopefully you know um, we won't lose anyone else, but there's no guarantees ever, so, you know, but the team is starting to shape up quite nicely, um, it's quite diverse, um, I think the only change that I would make is probably getting rid of the Metacham or the Heracross, but 
I like having Heracross on the team, so I'll probably get rid of the Medicham. Um, it won't be final as such, but it will certainly be uh, good in the short term to have a water type, uh, especially if I can get it to learn an ice type move just before the 7th gym um, because at the moment I don't really have anything for that apart maybe Medicham who has ice punch um, from the red shard people um, so yeah Level 39. I'll probably actually check when Pupitar evolves um, during the training sessions on the next couple of routes. Are you serious? It's the top one. It's not the top one. God damn it. It is the bottom one. That's fine, that's fine. So, this is the last trainer before the gym. Um, so, I will be ending it off uh, when, I, when I'm in front of Skyler. And then hopefully I can get Pupitar up to the uh, level before he actually needs to evolve. So, because if I could, then it would be nice to have uh, an evolution soon for Pupitar. And probably when I do my next big grinding session, like I did uh, just before in Nimbasa, I think it was when I trained up all the Pokemon in the PC I'll probably do another one of them and any evolutions which I get I will immediately get the camera and start um, recording the evolution because I know that evolutions can be good to see and then it just keeps you updated as well um, and it gives more uh, diversity in the episode as well so any evolutions which do happen during grinding I'll just shove in uh, at the beginning of the episode um, so just be on the aisle for any of them and hopefully if we don't flinch here okay so I'm gonna have to heal Real quick. Okay, I'm just gonna go for two area laces then. Depending on how much this does. Oh, wow, that is a lot of damage. So area lace, bam. And then hopefully if I don't flinch here. Oh dear. Is this? Yep, okay. Okay. I see how it is. Okay, it's all good. Um, yeah. God damn flinches all the time. Okay, so I think I'll definitely be putting in another Pokemon now. Um, I don't know what I'll be putting in, but I'll definitely be putting in another Pokemon, and you guys can see um, what Pokemon I put in at the beginning of the next episode. But for now, I will see you guys in the next episode. This has been MJPB, 
and I will see you guys next time. Peace.